first thing you do when you're trying to put in a grommet, you take your material, whatever it is. In this case, I'm using some black webbing. And then I figure out where I want my hole and I bring the hole punch up to that position. Because I'm using a three pound hammer, just one, two, maybe three times, and the hole punch is gonna go right through. I pull out my die, which is designed to take a number four spur grommet. I take out the male part of that spur grommet, which has the long shaft on it, and I put it face up on the die. I fit my fabric over top of that. The hole is perfect, so it snugly fits right over the shaft. Then I take the spur part of the grommet, flip it the spurs down, and line it all up. Then I take the punch, which inserts into the spur grommet and down into the hole of the die, and give it a couple of good taps. The spur grommet, being made of a softer metal, brushes into itself, and the spurs bite into the fabric. That means the grommet can't spin when it's inserted into the webbing. Plain grommets don't have the spurs, and technically, even if you set them in really well, they could spin in the hole. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? I don't know. In my business, we use spur grommets because they're just more secure. 